The human respiratory tract is of stunning complexity and airborne materials entering it show dynamic patterns of deposition on the airway walls. Wouldn't it be great if we could simulate this outside the human body? For instance, when developing inhalable drugs, we could perform preclinical trials in vitro and study drug efficacy and delivery simultaneously. Amazing cell culture models and multi-organ systems for this purpose are available, but we cannot make full use of their potential simply because achieving realistic dosing is so difficult. At Philip Morris International R&D, we have developed a new generation in vitro aerosol exposure system, the inhales, to overcome this limitation. The system is inspired by human respiratory physiology and anatomy and consists of a mouth module, an airway module and a lung module. Cell cultures can be placed and exposed to test aerosols in each module. The system is contained and surrounded by a ventilated climatic chamber. But how does it work? Let's, for instance, consider the use of a medical inhaler. The inhaler is mounted at the aerosol inlet of the inhales and actuated. The aerosol is pulled through the system by the action of the lung module and deposits on the cell cultures. Because the inhales closely simulates the conditions within the respiratory tract, the aerosol disposition is well aligned with the disposition in the human airways, and so are the biological responses to the exposure. This is the next generation of in vitro aerosol exposure systems. Developed by PMI.